伊丹十三があのスイートホームのファミコン化に成功したぞ呪われた屋敷に閉じ込められてしまった5人のテレビ取材班この5人を捜査して1人でも多く脱出させるのが君の使命ださあ逃げろグズグズしているという「スイートホーム」Released in 1989 for the Famicom. Sweet Home is a survival horror role playing video game developed and published by Capcom. It is based on the Japanese horror film of the same name. And tells the story of a team of five filmmakers exploring an old mansion in search of precious frescoes or paintings hidden there. As they explore the mysterious mansion, they encounter hostile ghosts and other supernatural enemies. The player must navigate the intricately laid out mansion, battling opponents with the five main characters and the limited weapon and health items available. This game features permadeath, and the narrative moves forward regardless of whether all characters stay alive, which can lead to up to five different endings. Sweet Home places an emphasis on puzzle solving. Item inventory management, similar to Resident Evil, and survival. The player must backtrack to previous locations in order to solve puzzles using items acquired later in the game. Wow, if this game was released in the United States and I got a chance to play it as a kid, this probably would have been one of my all time favorite games ever. It's a Resident Evil like horror RPG with permadeath, as I mentioned before. It has Really cool puzzles and a very rewarding progression system for your characters. It has spooky as hell environments, and even playing through this in 2022, it was a marvel in game design and fun. There were some minor issues with it, like some of the cryptic solutions of certain puzzles and situations, and there were some unbalanced sections. But overall, I found this game to be fantastic, and I would recommend it to any fan of horror games or RPGs. That was week one. Life has been long over.、Uh, the transform started, I think. Oh, there she is, Lady Mamaya transformed. I'm going to use a dress soon, maybe. You're safe. Lady Mamaya said you were here. She is at peace now. And the state is serene once more. Follow me.